Hi, I'm with Ali O'Neill, who stars in the VUT production of Dead Man's Cell Phone, which is premiering this weekend. Yes, on Thursday. All right, so on Thursday, okay. So um, tell me a little bit about the, about the play. What is Dead Man's Cell Phone about? It's pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> well, it is about a dead man's cell phone. Um, I, my character, Jean, um, she comes across the cell phone and the dead man, and for whatever reason, it she decides to answer it when it rings. And she keeps answering it and keeps answering it and kind of goes on this journey meeting all these strange characters in his life. And she kind of winds up in really interesting situations. <laughs> so, um, so, you know, what was interesting or different about playing this role? I mean, you know, like, what, what makes Jean fun to watch? <laughs> well, she's... She's a little awkward at times. Like I said, it's kind of weird that she would answer this phone. Um, and she really cares about each of these characters, even though she's never met them. Um, so she's just, kind of, she's just kind of an odd, quirky little character. Um, and the kind of characters she meets are really big, extreme characters. So she ends up in a fight. She ends up you know, going to these like alternate worlds. <laughs> she just kind of gets herself in trouble. So she's fun. That yeah, that definitely sounds interesting. <laughs> so, um, were there any difficulties in the production? Like any special difficulties in this production? I mean, you know, it's about a cell phone. So, you know, how, how does that play out on stage? Well, um, we do have to time the cell phone and me answering it, um, and that's kind of, kind of something you don't really think about until you're on stage and you're like trying to answer it. It's not stopping. You know, like you get in those weird kind of spots. Um, and I mentioned the fight earlier, and that was really challenging. We had to, we were doing fight choreography, um, and so we have all these different props that we deal with during the fight and stuff. Um, and so that was a challenge, but absolutely one of my favorite parts. Fight choreography is so fun. <laughs> uh, that you know that that makes you kind of sound like Jackie Chan, which is really cool. Like <laughs> Jean sort of Jean Chan, we Jean should go Chan. Jeannie there Chan. There you go, Jeannie Chan. <laughs> um, so you know, talking speaking about cell phones and. Um, you know, that this woman just gets this feeling to answer another person's phone, especially a dead person's phone. <laughs> um, you know, like, what does that say about our culture, you know, in this day and age? Well, I, I think it's really interesting to kind of explore that and, and technology in general. I mean, we have cell phones and Facebook and all the, and email even, you know, all these things that connect us, but at the same time um, disconnect us. And um, like I said, she meets all these different characters, and so she finds interesting connections with each of them, but the cell phone in the end sort of burdens her and, um, and takes her to a place maybe where she doesn't want to be, even though she thought she did. And I think it's very common in our culture to get so wrapped up in texting or in your Facebook messages that before you know it, you wouldn't even recognize that person on the sidewalk. And, um, and so she definitely deals with that. Um, and I think it's an interesting thing to, to reflect upon. <laughs> yeah, definitely. It kind of you know, makes you think about um, what it really means to be turned off. I mean, you've got, you're dead, but your cell phone is still going to be answered. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. Yeah. But um, so you said the play opens on Thursday. Yes. Where and when? And where can someone <laughs> get tickets? OK, it is Thursday at 8 o'clock. Um, it runs Thursday, Friday, Saturday at 8 o'clock, um, and then Saturday and Sunday at 2 um, in the afternoon. And it is in Neely Auditorium, which is on Alumni Lawn, kind of catty-cornered from Rand, right across from Tolman. Um, and you can get tickets all this week. They are on sale now. Or they're free for undergrads, so they're on, oh, sale, okay. for, they're on sale for general admission. But yeah, undergrads are completely free. Um, just bring your Vandy ID. And um, you can get a really good seat saved if you go in sometime this week, or there'll probably be some tickets left um, every night of the performance. That's awesome. I, I hate freeze. Freeze the best kind of payment that you can. Get. <laughs> <laughs> so um, yeah, it sounds it sounds really interesting, and I'm I'm pretty excited to go. I, I you know I wasn't gonna go, but now after talking to you, I think I think I'm going to. <laughs> right. You you just have to like see the like oddness that yeah. we're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. It's, De definitely a strange premise, but I think I think it's going to be a good one. Yeah, I'm really excited about it. All right. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.